Hello, everyone. I'm Mihai Vasco. I'm the CEO and founder of Modex. I'm very happy to be here in front of you, and I'm happy that we're sharing the same family at this point. <laughs> My name is Graham Thomas, and I'm the Chief Strategy Officer here at Modex, and today we're going to introduce you to the smart contract marketplace that we're launching. Okay, so we all know the value and the opportunity that is within blockchain technology. And we're all living in a bubble. The rest of the world's not on the same page with us. Presently, there's limited adoption, high costs in terms of implementing smart contracts, there's poor resources, limited trust, and a limited number of truly user-friendly applications. So what's the solution? We realized that we needed to create a connection between the development community and the end users who can ultimately benefit from this technology. We need to provide accessible smart contracts that are cost efficient, and we're going to do that by offering developer tools and trusted applications and user-friendly um, applications as well. So this is how it works. This is our ecosystem. On the left, you have developers who initiate a smart contract. That'll then go through a testing and approval process, which will um, include auditing, pen testing, um, IP verification, and then the smart contracts will be published to the marketplace and ultimately move into the hands of the buyers who will then deploy that technology with their applications or, or their enterprise or SME use case. <clears throat> the token's really great in our, our situation because it ties the whole ecosystem together. It really helps us solve the chicken and the egg problem by incentivizing the development community to produce the right kind of technology and IP and, and by seeding um, the participation from the enterprise and private sector. Our revenue model is very simple. 70% of platform revenue goes to the developers, which they can then choose to split um, between the developers who create, audit, and pen test the smart contracts. 15% is going to go to the company, and an additional 15% will go into uh, an evergreen pool to fund ongoing development of, of the ecosystem. Our tech stack right now, starting from the bottom up, we are focusing on the Ethereum blockchain initially. Obviously, that has critical mass for smart contracts at this point in time. But we recognize that there are a number of other very smart and innovative protocols coming to market that will also be supporting smart contracts. So those will also plug into the Modex platform. The Modex platform is, is a centralized um, application that will support dApps. Um, and on the top, that's where we see uh, our third-party APIs for um, existing applications and businesses to plug in uh, the technology to various sectors, whether it's fintech, insurance, real estate, or, or the, you know, the like. Thank you, Graham. So one of the differences between us and, and maybe some other projects that were an existing company, we have a track record. We're being, we've been operating on a market in the, in the structure that we are right now for three years. And we have a deep understanding of what corporate governance and the use of funds should look like. We've passed the due diligence of 12 investors so far. We, just, we raised 3 million and another 2 million recently. And we want to use basically an ICO and the, the use of proceeds in this case to build something for the community because it's very important to, 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 to give back and the venture funding is is not something that we're looking at at, at this point. So uh, if, we're, if we're looking here, we're gonna use the most, most of the, our proceeds for, for incentives. So we want to build, uh, to want to ensure that we recruit the top talent in our community <coughs> and that we bring the right flows into it. Yeah, so most of it on, on marketing and, and, and basically incentivizing the, 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 the programmers, but also building our, our network and our platform. Yes, so we provide easy access to the, to, to the platform and trust. Trust was the initial currency. It was forgotten for some time, but it has became the new currency at this point. And we understand how important is that for the development community. This is why with the, with the systems that we have in place, with the rating systems and everything related to validation and, and, and auditing, we are going to make sure that we recruit the top talents and the top, uh, the top uh, smart contracts on, the, on our platform. 
We have a very strong incentive program because we understand that the power is, it, is at the developers at this point. The companies need to follow that. And we plan to have, with the MOUs in place, because we're going to announce in the following weeks a set of MOUs, uh, incentivize that. Yeah, so Money Mail Me, it's a social money transferring app. It's our app. This is how we, we basically build a, a deep understanding of the consumer needs. It's an app that's already operating. We won the best social payments app in the UK award recently. And we have decided now to go to the next stage and develop a platform that will, will be also useful for the community. This is the team right now. We, have, we are recruiting. Uh, we like to call ourselves a team of teams. This is why we like to work in, in, in this, such an, uh, an environment we call ourselves a family. We recruit from Oracle, Microsoft, Temenos, Deloitte, and all the other big companies. And uh, we're trying to recruit some top talents in London and Bucharest and build a team accordingly. I would just add that this is our executive team, but we have a, a staff of over 40 already uh, on the technical side. Yes, and also we're adding some new advisors and some people that can really help us grow at this stage. Yeah, we'll be releasing uh, a number of announcements over the coming weeks to um, engage the community. Yes. Thank you. Thank you.